Hey guys, what Xantiquari here to bring you another tutorial. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to um, put an AI in a vehicle. This was a request, but it was also on the list of tutorials I still have to do, and um, I decided to go ahead and do it now. I uh, bought that recorder, actually, so um, we are good to go for a long time. Actually, for the next 22 tutorials or so, whatever. But uh, pretty simple, I'm just going to put an AI in a vehicle, and you can see my map right here I've been working on. I haven't really done anything with it besides add sand in a skybox. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much the point of that. So, on with the tutorial, tutorial number 11. First thing we're going to do is go up to uh, view, view open, pane. I'm, I'm just going to call that panel just because it makes me feel better, really. And uh, go over to vehicles, land and select a vehicle you wish to want have use I'm going to use the Asian LTV alright and you're also going to need a character select any character you wish I'm just going to select this just because it's very close alright and now I oopsies alright and now we are going to what are we gonna do? Oh yes. We are going to open up our flow graph. Alright, and we're gonna go up to file, new, and we are going to the first thing we're going to need is get a start. Miscellaneous start. You always start with this. Not always, but most of the time. And we are also going to need a um Oh crap, what are we gonna need? We are going to need a entity, an entity ID, and we are also going to need a vehicle enter. All right, put that right there just for conveniency. All right, now we are going to uh, have to select the vehicle. So just click on the vehicle like slow. So and um, right click on the ID up here, the entity ID and that do assign selected entity uh, now we're going to do the same for the Asian guy I was just said Asian chick for the Asian guy and but we're going to put him on the vehicle don't doubt me here I'm being completely and totally serious when I say add him to the vehicle it just works out, trust me. Alright, now we are just going to connect all this. We're going to take ID from the entity ID and put it to sync. And we're going to, no we're not, we're going to take ID and we're going to put that, ah crap. Where's my undo? There it is. There we go, alright. We're going to take ID to vehicle ID and we're going to take output from our start to sync. Alright, so it should look something similar to this right here alright now if you go down here to vehicle and you press on seat which is at, in, on our input see any we're just going to change him to the driver and we are going to save it um, AV to VE just going to override it and we're going to go out here and we're going to see what this bad boy does he gets in the vehicle like so and he sits so uh... that's tutorial number eleven um, in tutorial twelve i'll show you how to make him drive but uh... that's for tutorial number twelve which i'm going to do right now as soon as i press stop i'm going to do that right after it finishes and whatever but uh... yep that's tutorial number eleven go watch tutorial number twelve to figure out how to make him drive Exantacquire signing out.